Greetings, family. Yo, last week, I got an analogy I just had to share. And it was based on the concept of what they call companion planting on an agricultural level. You have two kinds of plants that I'm going to speak about. One is the marigold and one is the walnut tree. Now, see, marigolds are known to be paired with plants and they protect other plants. Other plants flourish, they grow, they expand, and they reproduce, and they are just healthier all around and more protected around marigolds. Adversely, you have the walnut tree. Now, the walnut tree gives off a toxic chemical which basically stunts the growth of other plants around it. It destroys crops sometimes, and it has a negative effect on the plants that it is planted next to. So the point of the analogy was, when you are a marigold, you are a positive person. People feel stronger around you, you uplift others, you bring others to the next level, and you are a spirit lifter. You are a light bearer. On the other hand, when you're a walnut tree, you are a energy sapping, negative, Debbie Downer person that just drains those around you. And the question you should ask yourself is this, because only you will know, am I a marigold or a walnut tree? Or maybe you're a little bit of both, but think about that and ask yourself, what can I do to be a blessing to other people? And think about the people in your life that are marigolds, that are protective of you, that make you feel stronger, better, more confident. You can do anything. You can conquer the world. You feel their light bearers in your life. And think of the walnut trees, the doubters, the haters, the people that try to make you feel insecure, less than. Doubt yourself. Worry that you're not enough. Be a marigold and stay your ass away from walnut trees. That was the best part I got to tell you. All right. So think in your mind, am I being a marigold and am I surrounding myself with marigolds? Real talk. Marigolds versus walnut trees. Which one are you and which one do you want to be? Peace.